Nate, how did it feel to just get a good game under your belt again? Not just you personally, but the, the whole entire team to sort of snap out of this funk that you guys have been in a little bit. Uh, it felt amazing. Uh, you know, we had a long season, and, you know, we've never given up, never. And we, it just felt great going out there playing hard with my teammates and, you know, getting up. Colby, at what point did it become apparent that Nate was in a, a zone tonight? Uh, I mean, I knew from the first three. I feel like whenever he is like his first couple ones, I know he's in that zone, so we got to give him the ball. But um, yeah, I mean, they shot the crap out of the ball tonight. So, and <laughs> was there was there anything else that you guys noticed tonight in terms of maybe the way you played or what the way that you were prepared to play that you felt like impacted your performance? Uh, yeah, I felt like we played with a lot of desperation. Um, we knew this was a must-win game for us. I feel like everyone came out there and played like that, and I felt like we really shared the ball in the offense. This is a question for both of you. Um, Coach Steele has told us that it starts with defense, and in that first half, you held them to 9 of 31 shooting, 1 of 10 from beyond the arc. You also out-rebounded them, I think, doubled them 24 to 12. How big were those two factors in pulling away? Uh, really big. We knew um, coming into the game, you know, we needed to get seven kills, and you know, sadly we didn't get that. We actually got six in the first half, but you know, we came out there and played hard on defensive end because we know how important it is, and we've been emphasizing it for this whole week, and we just had fun with it too. That's the real. That's the big part about it, really. Colby, you you say you know it's a must win. I think that's pretty obvious to everyone. But how much was it on your mind or on the team's mind that? you know, this is going to be Paul's last game in, in this building. Like, was that a, a factor in, you know, wanting to get this one badly? I mean, yeah, for sure. We wanted to send the seniors out the right way. So, I mean, I feel like everyone just had that extra uh, fire underneath them because we knew it was senior night for them. We want to send them out on the right way. What was uh, – what did you guys talk, talk about in the locker room after this one? Um, just <clears> – <throat> How, like I said before, how we didn't get the seven kills, and um, that's just that's just motivation for us, really, just to go out next game and accomplish that goal, get seven kills from the jump, or finish the game with seven kills. So that's most of what we talked about, and you know we celebrated the win. Uh, shout out to Georgetown, they have a very good program as well. Uh, either one of you, um, how important is a game like tonight going into this Wednesday in the Big East tournament? How important is it to carry the momentum? Uh, I feel like this was a big momentum game for us. Like we could have played anybody, but we just needed that for that one win to get us started. So that's all it takes. Uh, just piggybacking off Kobe, just, you know, that's all it took for us really. We a uh, momentum team and just keep it going from here. It's only up from here really. Were you guys aware that uh, your first 21 baskets you made in this game, you had 21 assists? Nah, I mean, I knew we were sharing the ball around. I didn't know it was like that though, but yeah, I feel like we shared the ball a lot on offense, and a lot of it opened up for a lot of people. Thank you. Guys. Thank you.